Every day, 24 hours a day, all of us use, consume, and rely on products that have been transported from one place to another. Businesses, farmers, retailers, and consumers all depend on a good freight system. Freight is the lifeblood of our economy, and its efficient movement is critical to our growth and prosperity. This is particularly important in the Western Cape, which is far from our country's industrial heartland, meaning that the goods on which we depend often have to travel a long distance. But our freight system faces challenges. Demand is expected to increase by 50% over the next 15 years, placing pressure on existing systems. In some parts of the province, businesses struggle to connect to markets. Some of our infrastructure is deteriorating, deficient or lacking capacity. Overloaded trucks damage our roads, costing the province millions. Driver fatigue in unroadworthy vehicles cause road crashes. Limited coordination means that there are more trucks on our roads than necessary, and a lack of good data makes informed decision-making difficult. Accidents, emissions and congestion cost the provincial economy 9 billion rand a year. Perhaps the biggest challenge is our over-reliance on road freight and the underutilization of alternatives. 93% of general freight is moved on road and only 7% on rail, which is often cheaper and would help to alleviate congestion, accidents and environmental damage. But rail has challenges too, like historical underinvestment, aging infrastructure and inconsistent service. The result is that transporting goods takes longer and costs more than it should. That increases the prices we pay for products, decreases the province's competitiveness and negatively impacts our economy. That's why we are moving forward with a provincial freight strategy and implementation program. We're collaborating and coordinating with all stakeholders to tackle these challenges and manage growth sustainably. Together, we're finding ways to encourage a shift from road to rail and other suitable modes of transport. Our province requires a balanced system where each mode carries the appropriate type and volume of freight. We're helping to improve infrastructure. We're promoting technology to improve freight efficiency. We're enhancing traffic enforcement and working to improve security. And we're proactively managing freight demand by improving efficiencies. The development of more well-located logistics hubs will help to achieve this. With government, the private sector and the public working together, we'll make freight transport safer, more efficient, more cost-effective and environmentally sustainable. The economy wins. Business scores. Jobs are created. The Western Cape succeeds. And everyone in it benefits.